in this video I'm going to show you a simple multi-container application that runs on Azure App Service this is the finalized version I already deployed it but uh, I'm going to show you this uh, this application it's a multi-container application uh, the front end is uh, Python uh, and the back end I think uh, the data is stored in inside uh, what is called let me check Redis database uh, so let's begin uh, <coughs> so I'm uh, creating a new app service my docker compose yeah. and uh, resource group will be created a new one I'm selecting docker container and uh, region I, I let it the default one and uh, I'm picking the free one but obviously you can upgrade and choose to your uh, requirement so next I'm going to docker the this will be docker compose and the image source uh, I'm selecting docker hub and access type equal to public. Uh, I'm just picking the networking section. Uh, this is the default monitoring. I don't need any monitoring. Tags, default, review and create. And I'm clicking the create button and wait for some time. And uh, the deployment is complete. So I'm clicking the go to resource. And I can see that this is uh, a web application is created and I'm going to the deployment center and uh, here I will need the docker compose file so uh, I will paste the docker compose content here so I'm just picking up my previously created one and testing it here you can choose your docker compose file and upload it but I'm just copying and pasting the whole thing here and clicking on the save button now it will it will pull all of the uh, containers uh, from the container re registry and uh, will deploy it uh, to my application so after completing that I'll be back so uh, the container configuration is saved and uh, if I and now click on the logs it will take some time to, to come the logs in, in this uh, in this section so let's wait for some time this is not coming I just had to uh, had to click or browse the application according to the URL I got uh, from this section sorry uh, from the domain section and you can see this is running and uh, the application is fully functional and yeah that's it and uh, it didn't took that much time uh, what I wanted to show you the uh, the logs those are coming from the, uh, the docker section I mean the doctor, docker container here is that thing Thank you for watching it.